In recent developments within the Republican Party, the possibility of Nikki Haley joining Donald Trump as his vice presidential running mate has emerged, according to sources familiar with the campaign's deliberations. Despite a historically cool relationship stemming from a contentious GOP primary, insiders suggest that strategic considerations might drive a partnership between the two. The former president faces several challenges, how, including a fundraising gap against President Joe Biden and substantial legal fees. Haley, on the other hand, retains strong connections to a network of donors who remain skeptical of Trump. Reuniting with Haley, who served under Trump as the United Nations ambassador, could potentially broaden his appeal, particularly among college-educated Republicans who have continued to support her. Interestingly, Haley secured more than 20 percent of the vote in Indiana's primary, which also saw participation from Democrats and independents. Yet, the potential alliance is complicated by their past and differing policy views. Earlier in the year, Trump dismissed Haley's presidential capabilities, and Haley questioned Trump's qualifications for office. Their policy disagreements are significant, notably on foreign policy, where Haley advocates for increased aid to Ukraine and its inclusion in NATO, a stance Trump does not share. As the political landscape evolves, Haley is focusing on maintaining her political base, planning a gathering in Charleston, South Carolina, to thank her presidential campaign donors. Her stance has been that Trump must extend an olive branch if he seeks unity within the party. Although Trump's campaign suggests that he already enjoys widespread GOP support. Despite this potential rapprochement, some of Trump's closest allies remain staunchly opposed to Haley joining the ticket. Prominent conservative voices like former Fox News host Tucker Carlson and Donald Trump Jr. have publicly declared their resistance to her candidacy emphasizing the internal divisions her nomination might exacerbate. As the Republican National Convention approaches where Trump is expected to announce his running mate, the political dynamics continue to shift. Although Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has explicitly declined any interest in the vice presidency, and Haley herself has sent mixed signals about her willingness, the political calculus continues to evolve. This situation leaves observers and party members alike watching closely as these strategic decisions unfold, shaping the future direction of the Republican Party and its chances in the upcoming presidential race.